Okay, that's a, a short piece from a book called Mel Bay Modern Method. Sorry, Mel Bay Modern Guitar Method, complete edition. And uh, it's volume two, and it's page 77. Now, the reason I'm recording it is um, I teach plectrum style arch top style guitar and uh, acoustic guitar and um, the students that come to me um, sometimes they have false expectations so <laughs> I've had some people book 10 lessons and say teach me to play like Joe Pass and I, um, it's completely unreasonable <laughs> And no one in the world can learn to play like Joe Pass in 10 weeks, never mind 10 years or 100 years. Um, so the classical students that come to me are prepared to spend three or four years, two or three years maybe, for some of them, really getting to know how to read music and study the theory and everything. Um, they realize they have to go through this kind of apprenticeship. Um, a lot of the um, plectrum, uh, arch top guitar players come from a rock or blues background, uh, used to reading tabs, um, and uh, they're, they're not prepared to learn to read as well as the, their classical counterparts. Um, and it's a shame, uh, but for those who do make the effort, uh, I highly recommend these books. Uh, yes, I've got books on Mel Bay, but um, it, honestly, these are the best books I've come across for learning plectrum guitar style. Uh, you get classical pieces, um, swing, jazz, blues pieces. You get uh, bluegrass, great for your technique. Um, all written out, no tab, and uh, lots of chords, and very modern at times. There's a, a lot of work on uh, quarto harmony uh, in the later pages. Um, so they're a great foundation. Uh, and actually, if you can re sight read through volume two, uh, you at a very high level of uh, reading. And that piece I've just played has four sharps in the key signature plus lots of uh, chromatic notes in the score itself. So um, a difficult read for most guitar players. So, um, But if you work steadily through this book, 
Um, you can do it with me in lessons or you can do it yourself. Um, and uh, yeah, you'll learn a lot. It doesn't teach you how to improvise. You know, jazz is a big subject. This is just getting the foundations, all the chords, the scales, arpeggios, and learning to read. Um, and uh, all very important stuff. There are other books and other methods of uh, learning to improvise. So there we go, that's uh, a little insight into that book. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm teaching uh, plectrum guitar. The books I use are, are these books, the volume one and two, uh, Mickey Baker, volume one and two, and um, uh, Elliot, um, solo guitar playing. Uh, I forgot his first name, Joel. Elliot, uh, solo guitar playing. Um, which is an excellent book um, uh, and happy to do other stuff too so I uh, hope to hear from you if you're looking for lessons uh, in this style, plectrum style oh P.S. <laughs> P.S. Um, the piece was written by William Bay uh, of well, we call him Bill, Bill Bay William Bay He's now the owner of uh, Mel Bay. He's the son of Mel. And uh, he writes brilliantly for a plectrum style. He believes that uh, a plectrum style acoustic guitar or electric amplified acoustic could be uh, used in a concert hall uh, as like a classical guitar sometimes. Um, so uh, he's written a lot of music. Uh, to be played solo plectrum guitar. Uh, it's called plectrum guitar style. It's a plectrum or a pick. I use a Gibson Extra Heavy, but you know, there's lots of different ones. Um, and it doesn't have to be an arch top acoustic, but uh, you know, I like it that way. It could be a regular acoustic guitar. Um, it could be an amplified guitar as well. So, you know. It's the style rather than the instrument, but I like it on the acoustic instrument. Um, okay, that's it now. <laughs> Bye.